Hello there, I'm Scott Ewart, and in this PC Answers tutorial, I'm going to show you how to map network drives for instant access to your, to your favorite folders over a network. Now, say if you've got a few people on your network, and you want to share files, so say if you want to transfer something from your folder into a computer elsewhere, um, the usual method is that you go down to... Uh, Go, we'll go to your start menu and go to network and then it will bring up a um, list of PCs you then double click into your PC and you go through the folders now that's the uh, obvious way of doing things now what you can do is you can you can map this this say if we want to go to this PC answers folder here we can actually map this folder as a drive letter so that when when we want to go to it instead of going to network and then collect it, clicking on the network and then the computer name and the folders and going through that method every time we want to transfer a file we can just go straight to the drive letter in my computer so it will actually appear under computer as a drive here now to add a uh, network drive it's incredibly simple so I'm going to guide you through that right now go to your start menu click on computer and up here in Windows Vista, you've got a map network drive. If you click on this, you'll be presented with a, a wizard. Now, you can select a drive letter here. Any drive letter that's not being used, you can, you, can, uh, you can apply. You're better off starting at the bottom end of the alphabet because Windows will automatically add its own letters for drives and other things. Now, now you need to um, specify the 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 location of the network folder that you want to open when you um, use drive Z now what you can do is you can manually type it in here if you know what it is as you can see in the example here slash server share or you can click browse and in browse we can go in and just select the folder we want so say if we want PC answers documents that's what we want so we just select that and click OK. Now alternatively you can actually type this in so if you know what your computer name is of the computer you need to get to like this is PC0457 is the machine we want to connect to and then slash users slash PCA slash documents. Now what you can do is if you note all this down you need to put the the two backslashes here at the beginning as um, that that denotes that this is a, a network connection and then the rest is just regular um, syntax um, and another feature of this is you can actually make it uh, reconnect at logon so if you know you're going to be using this drive letter often you can check this box and whenever you start your computer up it will automatically um, open up this folder as a drive letter so it will appear in your my computer here whenever you start up it will appear so once once we're finished we just click finish and it opens up the folder for you right here and if you go over here you can see down at the bottom network locations documents and it's drive Z it tells you how much space is free and how much is used and you can get straight in by just double clicking and then you're straight into that folder and you can you can drop files in, you can transfer files from your friend's computer or relative um, and basically share instantly. So once you're um, done with the drive and say if you don't want it to reappear, so say you know you're, you're not going to be connected to the same network for much longer and, and you don't really need this drive anymore or you, you decide you don't want to transfer as much or you've got some gadget that will do it for you. So what you can do is first of all you need to close all instances of the uh, of the the network drive otherwise it'll kick up an error and then once you're happy and you want to get rid right click and click disconnect it'll now be gone and when when you restart it won't reappear because you've disconnected the drive if you want to re-add it again you've got to go back to map network drive and then put it back in once again and as I say if you do the backslash and then if you type in the the exact um, server address 0457 yeah slash users 
slash PCA slash documents. I believe that's correct. We click finish. As you can see, I've added it by typing it in. So that's how you can quickly map network drives and share them. And, and, then, and then you can just transfer files by just dragging it straight into a drive letter that you've established, like drive Z.